with an unrecognizable name, almost no presence on social media, and a reluctance to step into the spotlight, Jan Horn is not your typical celebrity. But, in cybersecurity circles at least, the 22-year-old German shot to fame this month when he was revealed as the man who exposed the worst computer chip flaw ever. In uncovering the fault, which has existed for more than two decades but went completely unnoticed, he beat teams of analysts working from years of research. Even more incredibly, he stumbled across the defect by accident while reading through thousand-page processor manuals for a completely different project. Horn was actually trying to work out whether processors could handle an intense piece of number crunching code he had devised when he began picking through the doorstop size manuals last year, Bloomberg reports. His research led him to a process known as speculative execution, where a chip tries to guess what it might be asked to do next and starts performing that task ahead of time in order to increase speed. In doing so it starts fetching data from various parts of the machine and storing that information in its memory. Horn discovered that, even if the chip guessed wrong, the data it had retrieved would still be stored and could potentially be stolen by a clever hacker. Working from Google's Project Zero Lab in Zurich, he compared notes with other researchers before making his discovery. Chips could be tricked into retrieving data of a hacker's choosing, which could then be stolen. Daniel Gruss, part of a team at Graz University of Technology in Austria, was also working on the vulnerability at the time, but did not come to the same conclusion as Horn until months later. Gruss admitted that Horn's discovery astounded him. We were several teams, and we had clues where to start. He was working from scratch, he said. He developed all of this independently, that's incredibly impressive, he said. Horn informed Intel, the world's second largest chip maker, along with fellow manufacturers ARM and AMD in June. That set off months of scrambling to fix the bugs, now known to the world as Meltdown Inspector, which Intel claims is 90% complete. However, the flaw is so fundamental that fixing the final 10% will require the firm to build its processors in an entirely different way from now on. Horn Bruce and another team led by Paul Coker at a company called Cybris Technology merged their efforts in December, and by January a fix was ready. That was when Intel announced the flaw to the world, along with Horn's name, giving him most of the credit for the discovery. Rather than poring over processor manuals, Horn is now giving speeches to packed conferences filled with eager researchers desperate to know his secrets. But to those who know him, there is no grand secret, just a brilliant and unusual mind. Mario Heydrich Founder of Berlin-based cybersecurity consultant Secure53 which employed Horn before he joined Google, predicts great things to come. Has not a one-hit wonder, he told Bloomberg. This is what he does.